good morning it's not even morning anymore so today has been a stressful day but I am finally at the airport um, and I'm nervous good morning good morning good morning good morning so I'm in South Carolina I don't know if I picked up the camera I don't have the camera when Southwest broke my luggage and had to go buy some new ones. So, I'm in South Carolina. I'm in at Carolina Ross in South Carolina with my mom. And I have to come and get some more luggage because um, Southwest broke my luggage. So, now we're just looking. We have this one. I'm a black girl. Let me let me flip the camera around. Hold on. There's an option. So, we have this black one. We're trying to find a, a matching set to it because I have to get two. I have to get... The big one and the medium size and then i also i still have my um carry-on so we, we just have this one of the black one then we have this set which i really like and my other set was pink so i'm thinking about getting a color because it's always just like so easy to find my luggage um because it's pink so this was another color and then we also have this one the blue but I don't know. I think the blue is like a lot of color for me. I don't know. But it's also a Samsonite. And Samsonite is what I have of my carry-on. And I know it's good luggage. Because I've literally had that carry-on for years. And I know it's durable. So I don't know which one. We're also going to go to another store. Because one thing Kimberly taught me. Where's she at? I don't like pink. One thing Kimberly taught me is you never buy the first thing you see. So we're going to go to another store. Ain't that right? That's right. <laughs> and see what else we can find. But I know for now the orange and the blue are contenders. But yeah. I know I forgot the camera then, but um, I just been to South Carolina. Yesterday I went to my little cousins, Brandon's um, gaming place for Benedict. They had homecoming, so I went to a tailgate into the games to support him. The camera. Say hey, Rick. Um, and then now, but that was in Columbia. Now I'm back where I actually live, and in South Carolina. And I'm getting a COVID test because I'm gonna be going to well, out the country again, um, uh, very soon. Um, honestly, honestly, I really don't know when I'm going because I'm waiting. I broke my drone. I had to send that off, so I'm waiting for my drone because I don't want to go to this location without having a drone so i can get all the footage so i'm waiting on that um and once i get that i can leave south carolina and go back to la and then catch my flight from la to wherever i'm going um i think i honestly have already said where i'm going but we can pretend like we haven't and if i have i'm just bleep it out um so but before i can go anywhere i have to have a COVID test. so since i don't know when i'm actually going to be getting on my flight to go where I'm going. Um, I'm just gonna get a COVID test every single day. Um, until I go. Cause you have to have it at least um, 72 hours before, so. I'm pulling up now, I'm at CBS getting my COVID test. Hold on. Hey you. Oh, do I have a mask? Oh no. Hi, I'm here for a COVID test. Michaela Savage. Good morning. It's not even morning anymore. So today has been a stressful day, but I am finally at the airport. Um, and I'm nervous. That's my flight. One second, I'll be back. Okay, I'm back. So, like I was saying, um, I'm a little nervous. I am a little nervous. So, this is the first time that I've like I've been out of the country before, but like I haven't been out of the country like this before. My first flight. I don't even know how long it is. I think it's like. 19 hours i have no clue i just 
I just know I'm gonna be on there. Um, but I'm going to Tokyo first. I have a layover in Tokyo, and then I have another flight. And I have another flight. I think I have three flights, two layovers, three flights. And then I will be in my destination where I will quarantine. After my quarantine, I fly to another destination. So, I, um, it's a lot. But I'm gonna vlog this whole experience. Let me go. I'm gonna I'm gonna show y'all what I got on the plane. My seat. So yeah. All right. So I just got to my seat. Um, it's a nice seat. All right. I ain't never traveled like this before. So I'm traveling to business class. And let me show y'all what we're working. <laughs> So this is the seat when you walk up. We have this nice size television. I guess something will be playing. I don't know. And then we got all the compartments. So I got a compartment there. Oh, oh we got a mirror. Period. Um, we got a little coat hanger. Let's see what else. We have, um, I don't know what this is. They gave us some water, some headphones, this little packet that has, I don't know if y'all can hear me or not, that has a face mask, hand sanitizer, and a little disinfectant wipe to wipe everything down, which I've already done. We got some more, oh, we got some little chargers and things. And then the seat. And then, you can kind of see it more for my neighbors, but that's what it's looking like. Period. But let me go because I'm acting like I ain't never been over here. And I'm, I'm lucky the only person in business class. I want to see what first class look like. I want to see what I want to see what first class look like because this will be first class to me. So this the business class. Imagine what first class looks like. So, but let me go. Just bought out the first appetizer of our meal. So it's, it's a Indian chicken salad. Um, and then I got champagne with some mimosa now. Hello. Oh, joy. Thank you. Really good. <laughs> and then I believe that that's butter. Salt and pepper. But yeah, I'm excited. Tokyo. If you can't tell, I'm a little tired. Um, it is currently like, I think Tokyo is 16 hours ahead of the United States, America. Well, of LA, of LA. Um, it's 16 hours ahead. So it's maybe like 2 o'clock, 2 o'clock in the morning there. But I am tired. I'm sorry. My friend's sending me something. But, um, 
My flight is delayed. I have one more leg. I have another leg over in Singapore. And that flight is delayed, so I'm just sitting here in Tokyo. Um, I'm gonna come back to Tokyo. Because the people are so nice. Like, I forgot my boarding pass on, um, on the flight. And they gave me a new boarding pass. I mean, that's their job, but it was it was just the way they did it like the way they were talking and it was just so sweet so i'm gonna come back to tokyo but now i'm just sitting here i'm trying to keep up with this vlog thing because literally when i was on the plane my friend avery um she messaged me and i was like i'm vlogging for you so avery this is for you because i'm keeping y'all updated but I really want to go to sleep in this chair right now. But I'm going to just wait here. If my flight gets delayed again, I'm going to go to the lounge. I'm going to teach all my tips and tricks. First off, we have the ebook coming soon. Ebook is coming soon. So at the, I'm, I, I might mention it in the ebook, but I'm going to tell y'all how to get in all of the lounge, the airport lounges where you can get the free food, the free drinks. You can sleep there, you can shower there. So, um, if it's not in the ebook, then I don't know. I'll just do a YouTube video on it or something. I don't know. I don't know how we'll do it, but we'll figure it out. But I'm gonna just sit here and maybe close my eyes, rest my eyes for a little minute into my flight board. But first leg down, 10 hour flight down. We still got. I think 10 more hours to go or 13 more hours to go until I'm finally in my destination and I can finally sleep. And I'm gonna sleep good because I got a quarantine for five days. So I'll see y'all on the next flight. Bye. just landed in Singapore. I've been here for a couple, about an hour. Um, and I'm just sitting in the lounge. I'm telling you, the lounge access will save your life because I could not just sit in the airport because my layover in Singapore is for eight hours. I definitely could not sit here for, or well, sit out there for eight hours. Um, I just can't do it so with the lounge it's more comfortable like you have better chairs um all the food is free all the drinks are free you can even get alcoholic drinks um this one has a shower um i keep going back and forth if i want to take a shower or not because i went in there and they aren't they're nice but they aren't that nice so i keep going back and forth but another lounge open this is the 24 hours 24 hour lounge that I'm in. The other lounge opens um, at 5 a.m. It's currently like 2 30 or something like that. Um, and then my flight leaves at like 9 55. So I can go in there at 5 a.m. See what that lounge is. a nicer lounge. Um, see what that one's looking like. If I decide to take a shower, I can. But my flight to Jakarta is only two hours. I think it's like one hour and 45 minutes so it's not that and then i'm gonna be quarantining in jakarta for five days so if i just want to just wait to i get to my hotel to take a shower then i will but it just feels how i feel but right now i'm about to take i just opened my bag so i'm about to take a vitamin pack um i don't feel like sick but i have been like up in the air around people so i'm gonna take a vitamin pack just to be careful just i'm trying not to get sick um and then i'm gonna go over here and try to find some food i'm i'm gonna show y'all the lounge because this this was really cute this was really cute this one they, they said that it's not their big their nicest lounge but it's a nice lounge so um i'm gonna show y'all the seats 
and then I'm gonna go up there and show y'all the food area, the drink area, all that stuff like that. Um, but yeah, we we close. We're so close. We just gotta get through this layover and then get through a two-hour flight, and then we're in Jakarta where we can quarantine for five days, and then after Jakarta, we are gonna go to our final destination. Finally, um, but yeah. Yeah, let me show y'all this lounge. So this is the lounge. It's a really nice one. This is where I'm sitting. I just have all of my things here. Oh, don't mind my my Welch's gummies. I took these out of my bag because I just wanted a little snack. But down here, I think I think this is like actually another lounge. But this is the only one that's open right now. Over here. We have the food. All the food. Hello. Could I get some cornflakes? Yeah, of course. Okay. You can have you, Thank you. So I think my camera died when I was showing the lounge, but I'm actually about to, well, actually my camera didn't die. This camera was already dead. My phone, which I was vlogging on, ran out of storage. So <laughs> there's just a lot going on, but I'm actually about to leave this lounge and I'm about to go to the other one because I didn't really like the food in this one. And um, the other lounge, I think it's like the Singapore Airlines lounge, which is what I'm flying. Um, it opens at five, so well, it opened at five. It's five thirty now, um, so I'm head over there and see what they got. Hopefully, got some food because I'm getting a little hungry. I still got. Oh, that's my drone. I don't know if I told y'all, but I broke my drone, ran it into a wall. And they just emailed me saying that they're about to ship it out so my mom is just gonna have to ship it to me when i get to my destination but anyways i, I just be talking <laughs> i just be talking so it's 5 30 i still have until my plane boards at 9 55 8 55 one of those i have to check my boarding pass again but um i still got a little minute so i'm gonna head over here see what they talking about and yeah yeah i'm ready to get on this plane and get in a hotel i'm i'm over it at this point like i've been traveling for 24 hours even though it does not feel like it's been 24 hours it feels like it's been maybe 12. it does not feel like i've been traveling for 24 hours which is crazy so anyways let's go you serving for today um, and then also on this table is the Wi-Fi password so I can already tell like this lounge is better just the way that it looks the way that 
like the people walk you in and explain everything to you like the other lounge is like all right just sit down <laughs> so i can already tell like this is better so i'm about to scan this and see what they're serving oh my my phone's in my bra let me see what they serving today First, you have to connect to their Wi Fi. <sighs> the first row is. And then one thing also I like about the lounge is like I feel more because I do travel by myself like I feel more comfortable leaving my bag where I'm sitting because I don't want to lug my luggage around when I'm going to get pick up my food or I'm going to to the restroom or stuff like that if I was in like the regular terminal definitely would not feel comfortable just like leaving my bag but my table is D27. I definitely cannot do two things at once. <laughs> okay, let's see what they're serving for breakfast. For breakfast, they have the breakfast set. It's a platter of pork bacon, crispy hash browns, sticks, croissant, and scrambled eggs. Definitely, that sounds good. I told y'all this, this lounge is so much better with the food. Then they have an Asian menu. I think I'm going to get enough Asian food. So I'm going to skip the Asian food. They have a hot sandwich for under Western. They have a hot sandwich. It's like a ham and cheese sandwich. They have a vegetarian menu. Light bites. They have salads. Soup. And then they also have a kids menu where it's chicken nuggets with french fries. Definitely going to get the breakfast set. That's what it's looking like. So yeah, we're gonna do this. And then um and then I'm gonna remember where we sign up you if we place your order. Place my order then. Alright, it'll be, it'll be ready in 15 minutes. But I'm just gonna wait on this and then I'll show you all my food when I get it. But now I'm gonna go get me some drinks. But yeah. Shout out to the lounges. I am gonna break down how you get into all the lounges though. Just probably when I get in my hotel and not around all these people because sometimes people just be looking at you weird when you be talking to the camera so <laughs> I'm way too low I'm so low so low to explain everything but alright all right, so I just got my food. This is what it is. I got the croissant, um, hash brown, eggs, and bacon, and then I got orange and apple juice. So I'm about to eat this. I'm on the phone with my mom. Say hi, mom. She, they can't hear you because I forgot you was in my AirPods. But yeah, she said hi, guys. So I'm about to just eat this, talk to her, and yeah. We got about like five minutes to two dollars a minute from the closet. Here, um, and then they give you a mini pack that has um, body wash, because you take a shower and clean. Body wash, um, deodorant, toothbrush. Yeah, let me try these things. Let me see what I'm about to do. I'm about to do. Here's my food. I should have them. I heard about some um, salt and pepper. And cheese is really good for you. I'm probably not going to buy that, y'all. <laughs> so I'm about to board my flight to Jakarta. And I have to go through, um, I guess, TSA again. I don't know. I'm sending you a slime. I'm going to show you. 
so that's the line and then it's a security checkpoint so I guess after that then we can board our flight but I don't know I guess because we're going into Indonesia that we have to go through TSA again but that's okay but yeah I'm just sitting in line I hate lines I tried to skip it because it was two lines and I was trying to see if one was business and one was economy but they're mostly they're both the same thing so that's okay but I've enjoyed my time in Singapore I have to come back I, Singapore is on my list of places to travel let me flip the camera Singapore is on my list of places I want to go to but I just couldn't this trip or maybe when I leave Bali excuse me Maybe when I leave the place that I'm going, I can go to Singapore. But um, because I was gonna do Singapore as my visa run, but because I have a visa that's for six months, I don't need to do that anymore. So, but I'm gonna come back to Singapore. No time. But let me board this flight so I can get to Jakarta and go to sleep. So I just boarded my last flight of this leg of the trip and I'm so excited so this flight is only two hours right now I'm about to clean off all the things because nobody is getting sick nobody is getting sick over here okay we're a few kids get some champagne and I'll see y'all in Jakarta so we just landed in Jakarta and I just want to pick up the camera because I know once I get off this airplane and into this airport I'm not gonna do nothing I'm not gonna vlog I just have to go through immigration and get my visa and all that so I'm gonna just pick up the camera now so y'all I'm in Jakarta and I'll see y'all at my quarantine hotel. And I think that's the next time. Or maybe in the car when I'm driving to the hotel. We'll see. We'll see. But I'm glad I'm here. I'm glad I'm safe. And I thank God. Because it's been a journey. And I'm ready to go to sleep. So. Bye. Alright, 
so I have officially made it to my quarantine hotel. Um, I got here maybe 45 minutes ago. I've taken a shower, done my skincare, um, and low-key, I'm about to get into bed. But I just want to thank you guys for watching my journey from LAX to Jakarta. Um, like I said, I do have to quarantine here for five days, which I will be vlogging in a separate vlog. Um, before I can go to my final destination. So, I just want to thank y'all. Don't forget to comment, like, and subscribe. And I will see y'all later. Bye. We're looking for your friend The one you let hit it and never called you again Remember when he told you he was about to bench a man You act like you and him They give him a little trim to begin